Hey guys, uh, Rick Nice is back tomorrow, GTA 5. So we're playing this Mark at moment, waiting for a phone call actually from that guy from Bureau. I got it last time um, after I finished that mission, but it didn't save, so. Because it was mid mission. It starts with automatic, so we're waiting for that phone call. Basically, it tells you to go meet Trevor. So that's what we'll do when we get the phone call. The Santa. And there it is. That's not the name in your file, Michael. Steve Haynes here. Yeah, Agent Douchebag. Hey, that poor son of a bitch we grabbed for you still breathing? See for yourself, right now. Trevor Phillips is on his way to help with the debrief. Warehouse, off Dutch London and Banning. Great. Sounds just like my kind of party. Okay. That was a phone call, so let's steal a car. Steal a fast car, at least. Oh, ah, you get. <coughs> Sorry about coughing to Mike. So I can I can play as Trevor now, but I don't think I'm going to, because he'll be on his way there as well. So I may as well just get there and then switch to him. So I've noticed we're doing a lot more co-op missions now. Right? I can't remember the last time I did a solo mission. I think it was that when um, Michael got drugged up. Yeah, I think that was the last one we did. Because um, even Franklin's solo missions had Trevor in it. It's actually quite a nice car. This what is it? Shit. Looks like we are playing Trevor then. I pressed down on the D-pad, I didn't think that did anything. What the hell are you doing? You having a shit? Oh my god, you actually are! Sweet Jesus! What the hell are you doing? Oh, nothing! Are you taking a dump? Oh, why do you care, huh? The fuck is wrong with you? Uh, I got abandonment issues. I see a shrink once a week. You know, fuck you. Yeah, well, you know. Nothing like meeting a bunch of creeps from the government in a quiet building for someone to grow balls. <coughs> you see his face that last time I popped it. <laughs> Boom! Oh, ladies! God, asshole. You, you back there. I know you, but you? You I don't know. Yeah, well, until I see reason otherwise, why don't we just keep it that way? Steve, what a pleasure, bro. Oh! He <laughs> <laughs> reminds me of one of those guys you see advertising pills for middle-aged men. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Devin Weston is a very good friend of mine, so why don't you watch your tongue? Because let me tell you something, that guy gets more tail than, uh... <laughs> than a tail catcher! <laughs> oh, good one. I have to fucking remember that line. <laughs> <laughs> Where did we meet? Nowhere, pal. Yeah, we did. Hey, oh, what are we doing here, huh? This. Please, keep the sleep out of the way from me. Oh, uh, I know what this is. He's gone. I naturally He's know what this gone. is. It's okay, I've got some new friends here now. No, this okay. is Michael. And this. This is Trevor. No. Now, our friend here. He claims he doesn't know I anything. Don't, I don't know anything. I don't know. I already told nothing. Nothing. I don't know anything. Please. Please. Sir. You know about the Azerbaijanis? Huh? Azerbaijanis. I do audiovisual, hi-fi audiovisual. It's top man, good price. VIP. You know? So, You're a so. fucking spy. <laughs> and the asswipes at the agency know this. No. So I need to know. Oh, I know what he's doing. Them, and what did they tell you? I, I, told, hmm? I told them what I tell you. Uh huh. What? I. Hey. This whoa, 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 what is this? The house in Rockwood Hills. The man who owns it. He works at the consulate. Oh, that's all I know. That's it. That's it. That's it. I go. You're gonna make him speak. No, 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 no. You two are gonna drive up to Rockford Hills. No. And when we find out which man is the man with the problem, you put him down. No, 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 no. Because no, I'm tired no. of these fucking nitwits at the agency taking all the glory. Let me go. All right, fuck is all this, huh? I think it's a good time, buddy. You know? Go for a drive. Wait, wait. No. You get to work, and, uh, I'm not here. Okay. It's Caesar's place, around the corner right. from your house. Right. We're not doing the Trevor bit yet. <coughs> so I won't warn you about that yet. But I do know what happens. 
I will give you fair warning before it so you've got a chance to look away. But I won't ruin it now. Unfortunately, I've got to watch it. I've been told about it by my friend who's a bit further in front of me than like this. I was you, I wouldn't be so critical of who others associate with. So is he gonna be a problem? For sure. But there's nothing we can do about it. If something happened to him right now, I'd be right under a microscope. An electron microscope of bureaucratic shit. And that would make it very difficult to keep old secrets. Oh, well. Well, so, uh, for you. You know who else is having trouble keeping secrets, asshole? Me. After you brought Trevor in on this. I only brought him in after you put out your press release. Townley's taking scores again. The Los Santos reboot. If we didn't control the situation and he'd unearth this connection, then what? Then Trevor flips out, beheads me, kills my family, or raises them as his own. <laughs> which is worse. Anyway, any of that could happen at any time. Slow down. Let's think this through. What does he know? He knows I'm alive. He knows I got money. And now he knows I'm working with the FIB. Does he know how long you've been working with the FIB? How long? The fuck does that matter? Either you were working with us before the cash depot job, you walked your crew into an ambush, one of them spent ten years on the run, and the other landed in a federal penitentiary, or... Or... We stumbled on the cash depot job, Brad went down, you went down, Trevor got away. The FIB cut you a deal on your sickbed, faked your death, and you end up here. Who's to say which of those is true? That there's any doubt probably accounts for you being alive. Back there, Trevor made you right away. The second he saw you. You remember after the bust, I was in all the papers. I was on the evening news. The man who killed Michael Townley. Yeah, I was quite a trophy. A good head to hang on your wall. Back then, sure. Not now. Um. What? This is bullshit. This place? Davy, they've been shooting the real cunts of suburbia here the last few weeks. No way that's your guy. Shit. You are kidding me. I'll call Steve. wrong house this guy is an our guy okay 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 you sure you don't silence him just to make sure we're silencing someone we're silencing the right someone get me another address all right and we went wrong place all right turns out that was the wrong here's your warning hang on i'm gonna pause if you want to look away now i'm trying to top corner it says torture him I know what Trevor does, I'm going to warn you now, he rips out his teeth. If that bothers you, I'd look away. It bothers me, but I've got to watch it. address from Mr. K. Choose your instrument and go to work on him. Where do we start, eh, buddy? Wait, what are you talking about, the wrong guy? No, who do you want? Just tell me what you want, huh, man? Ah, huh, please, look at me, please. Well, let's get it out of the way, then. Aren't you a lucky boy? I just have the blazer! Oh. Right. Look away when you come. Ah! Ah! Actually, it wasn't that bad. Is to stop him being able to talk. That too much! <laughs> Mr. Phillips, ask him about Tahir Javan. What didn't you ask me? I know it's here. I did his home theater. <laughs> he lives in Jumash. The right on the Western Highway. Well, that wasn't so tough, was it? Huh? <laughs> did you get that? Did you hear him? Lives in Jumash, the Western Highway. Okay. Jumash. You're driving. Remember, terror does not take coffee breaks. <sighs> what a That's littering, you know. <laughs> Chumash. Okay. So how are Steve and Trevor getting along? 
Seems like a productive relationship. You know, like I said, he's got his uses. And as you can see, we're trying to take full advantage of him. Then by ripping people's teeth out. The agency gets put to rest, and we don't need you anymore. Right. And it wasn't as bad as I expected to be. I see, my friend described it a lot worse. Solution, Davey. You let him walk. You said you'd clean the whole thing up back in North Yankton. And you told me it'd be a clean job, no casualties. There were more eyes on that. Oh great, controller's gonna. There we go. Yeah, well, Roll the next box one again, Trevor's as I always say. Dave, as much as he is mine, he's not a problem at all. We're monitoring him. Has he said monitoring anything him. about Brad? Fuck yeah, he has. Plenty. I keep changing the subject. You know, he thinks you might actually commute Brad's sentence when this is all over. That's good. Fine work. We'll send another letter. It's about time anyway. Oh, so that's you who's been sending those fucking letters to Trevor, huh? Yeah. He thinks they're from Brad, who he thinks is locked up in high security and not, well, not six feet under in a grave marked Michael Townley. The trainees... What? Were, it's a good exercise. Yeah, the fuck. How'd that so that guy's started? dead, then? A few years ago, a letter came to the federal prison Shut system up. addressed to Brad. This'll do. Alright. Find out <coughs> what we're looking for. Yeah, we need a description of the target. Yeah, uh, I'll take care of it. Loosen him up. No, no, please! I tell what? you what Loosen you him up! No, no, please! Okay, what can we use now then? Don't want to rip any more his teeth out. I said loose. It's a torture. It hurts. I will drown. He'll drown. I got blood in my mouth. Say this. Oh, torture. My mouth. I, I will drown. Oh, oh. Oh right, this is what we're doing, is it? Always by the book. That's my mind. You wanna talk yet? He's wet alright. Let up. Yep, he comes. I'm alive. I'm alive. It no shit. A dream. It's a nightmare. Hey, 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 hey. Now? Huh? Now? You ready to talk? I've been ready to talk. Today I got to give now. The sick of the That's what we were afraid of. So, yeah, 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 yeah. This guy we're after, what does he look like? I was built. I was like middle age. Yeah, yeah. It sounds like you're stalling. This better be enough. Middle age, middle height, middle build, whatever. He's dark, okay? He's Azerbaijani, for God's sakes. Look around. Is that enough for you? <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's racist. I feel racist doing this, but... We're live. Don't think that's him. anyone down there who might be an Azerbaijani? fuck do I know? You might be an Azerbaijani, for all I know. <laughs> Azerbaijani. They look eastern. Perhaps this town looks eastern, Davey. You got the fall of the Shah and the collapse of communism to thank for that. Anyone stand out? No, they all kind of blend in. Make a call, Dave. We're gonna need some more info on this guy. They're having a party down there. Okay. Switch to Trevor. Can't you just do it automatic? That ain't gonna cut it, my friend. Shit, shit. I, let me think. I remember. <laughs> Sorry, too oh, late, Trevor. Show our contestant what he's won today. I remember. Oh, okay. I remember. I remember. Uh huh. Right. I think we're gonna use the monkey wrench. It ain't even the biggest tool in the room. What? <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Come on. Kneecaps. I'm thinking probably kneecaps. Knee yep. So what have you got for us? Hmm? We need Trev to shake up your memory again? No, 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 He's got beard. He's got beard. He's got beard. He's got beard. Uh-huh. No, I think you're making this up. No, no, I'm not. No. Yeah? I'm telling the truth. Bushy beard? Got any beardy types at this party? Huh? Because that's all Mr. K's given us. No. You know, I'm thinking maybe we ought to just take two bullets and put them in our informant and just call an airstrike on Chumash Beach. I need Beard. eyes on that party. Pick up the scope and give me a report. Who am I looking for? 
Steve saying beard. What do you got? Anything specific, or is some He's stuff got gonna cut it? Let's start at Mountain Men, and we'll work our way down until someone fits the profile. Now, there's a He's got bears. At this party, Vinewood's full of weak chins. Place is famous for it. Damn. He's got bears. Beards are in fashion in Chumash. Land of beach hipsters. We need more. It's a good time forever. Okay, so you give us some intel on our target. <coughs> yep. He smokes like wow. a fucking chimney. I don't know. Trev, maybe one more time? Just to be sure. No, please, no. Uh -huh. I told you, he smokes. That's all I know. Uh-huh. Right. I'm thinking... One more time. Not the clip. Not the clip. On, On his nipples for a guess? Me. Don't think I will. I will die. Go on, tell me. Please, come on. No, 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 no. You'll run out of juice. Don't kill him. Oh, look at the trouble in his back. I guess Did I kill him? Techniques were a little too advanced. Rise and shine. How'd you do that? All oh, right. Let me go it. <laughs> Mr. K. <laughs> Mr. K. I don't know anything, you please. <laughs> okay. He chain smokes. <laughs> And he's left handed. What's that? He chain smokes. And he's left handed. Ah, okay. <laughs> Any of these bearded guys at the party smoke cigarettes? Mr. K says he smokes like a pack of two a day. Redwood cigarettes? Thank you, Mr. K. Okay. He's telling me he chain smokes redwoods. He's smoking. Cigarettes that'll kill him. And he's got he's a beard. Put the warnings on the packets you should worry about. And he's left handed. Left -handed. Oh, now I get it. You're telling me to assassinate a guy because he's got facial hair. A cigarette. It's this guy. And he's left-handed. It's this guy. Ah, I see someone. He fits the profile. Yep, fits it all the way. I got a good feeling. About well, as good as you can get while clipping a guy who probably don't deserve it. I'm now gonna shoot I'm him. taking the shot. I'm gonna do it now. Baby, I got Stone. someone. Definitely a lefty. Redwood smoking, beard, <coughs> maybe, could be, used to be, Azerbaijani. Good enough for me. Steve, it's done. Nice job. Ooh, that is a wrap, my friends. Excellent work, the pair of you. Now, I got a racquetball uh, game to get uh, to, so Trevor, uh, if you take care of Mr. K, I think we're all set. Okay. What do you want me to do with him? I would say he's outlived his usefulness. Oh, come on. Please. Shut up. That's a sport. <laughs> <coughs> let's go, come on. Wait a second, me too. Fuck, let's just go, okay? I ain't gonna let those G-Man fucking scumbags tell me what to do. Oh, what? You just tortured me. Don't ask too many fucking questions. Let's go, get up. Come on, up the fucking stairs. We're not gonna kill him, are we? No, oh, for fuck's sakes. Come on. Let's go. All right. Now you got a flight to catch. Okay? Let's get you to the airport. Okay. We're a taxi service now, apparently. Let's go. Hey, how's your mouth? It hurts. Can you speak? <laughs> kind of. Are you going to hold it together? I don't want to go home. I want to see my family. No, 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 you have no home. You have no family. That shit is over. I do. They're in the morning wood. I love them very much. No, that's your old life. That's over now. You're off the grid. You're one of the invisible people. Just take me home. I'm taking you to the airport. You're going to get on a plane. You're flying a long way from this country, and you're going to spread your message. I don't have a message. 
You're a torture advocate! Advocate? The media and the government would have us believe that torture is some necessary thing. We need it to get information, to assert ourselves. Did we get any information out of you? I would have told you everything! Exactly! Tortures for the torturer, or the guy giving the order to the torturer. You torture for the good times! We should all admit that! It's useless as a means of getting information! I'm feeling lightheaded. Sometimes you torture for the torturee, but only if they're prepared to pay. I am very unwell. <laughs> Departures! No one drives me to the airport. Be. Oh, you get. You're free. Oh, oh, what? But my family is here. Your family is probably the ones who got you fucking in here. All right. And look, trust no one. All right. You're alone now. Really? Yeah. Really. Now let's go. Fuck off. Come on. Is he running away? Oh god. He's fell downstairs, alright, great. Not my problem anymore. Job done. <laughs> Don't stop me now. Whoops. Electrocutioner, the two thirds, wrenched and it's legal, 90% silver. I'm guessing we killed him, that's what's done the Don't Stop Me Now. So continue, mission done. So yeah, sorry about that mission, it was a bit graphic, weren't it? Anyway, I'm gonna end this part here. Thanks for watching, if you like this please like, favourite and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye!